What's going on, YouTube? Did you miss me? It's your guy, Mr. DCYLP. A package just came in today, baby. Yeah, I said a new package that I got to show y'all. But before I do that, check out my intro. Package. It took about 30 days to get to me. That's including, you know, the production time and the shipping. All right, these are those silicone heat transfers that I mentioned a while back. If you're a true loyal subscriber, you've been following all my videos. I told you that I got some unfamous silicone patches made. Package it up real nice, like triple freaking packaging. You can see where I'm taking this the amount, the level, the thickness, the quantity that I ordered. All right, game sheet, of course. I'm just gonna pull one of these joints out. Mm. Packaging stink though. But I'm pleased with the way they came out. Game sheet. We got one, two, three, four large ones and six small ones. You guys see the detail? All right, so I'm gonna take these joints up into the lab and get them pressed up on some fabric. I ain't gonna use no quality fabric because I've never used this type of application before. So I'm just gonna use some cheap shit real quick just to see how they come out. All right, but this is the 3D silicone heat transfer application on famous logo that I'm gonna be releasing. All right, now, make sure you guys, mm, pardon me for this Kettle One break. Shout out to Kettle One. Y'all don't sponsor me right now, but maybe one day y'all will. All right, before this video ends, make sure you hit that thumbs up, make sure you hit that bell notification so y'all don't ever miss nothing. And if you haven't done so yet, y'all make sure y'all hit my Patreon too. The link gonna be in the description below. I saw some people hating on the fact that I got the Patreon now, but we gonna get into that though, all right? Sounds like the newbies, the unloyal people be hating. See, that's why I created that Patreon anyways. For people like y'all, hating asses. But enough of that. Let's get up in the lab. Let's get some of these joints pressed up. See how they come out. And y'all let me know what y'all think. Let's get it. Two seconds later. All right, now since they gang she's I got to cut these joints out real quick, y'all. So bear with me. All right, now I'm going to press one of these joints up on this cheap crew neck sweatshirt, you know, that I bought for my son. They ain't no real quality type sweatshirt. This is just for, you know, sampling purposes. We're going to see how this joint come out. Hey, yo, to tell you, hey, yo, it's a foul odor, too. Like, these joints stink, man. I don't know if it's, I don't know if it's the silicone or I don't know, but they smell foul. Piercing to the nose. But um, they sent them with these uh these cover sheets also. But they ain't send no app. They ain't send no instructions pertaining to, you know, the temp or or seconds or anything to press these joints at heat press is set at 320 so we're just gonna clamp this thing down and see what happens all right i'm got my tripod with me right now y'all so i'm gonna got one hand holding the camera all 
It's firm though. And it was set for 15 seconds. Let's see what happened. I don't know if see, I don't know if it's cold pill or hot pill because they ain't sending any instructions. Hey, and it looked like it's not ready. Let me press it down. Let me press it without the cover sheet as well. For another 15 seconds. see what we got here yeah it might be it might be a cold pill because it looked like it's about to lift so we're gonna come back to this it was definitely a cold pill okay now it feels good but as far as the thickness can't really tell I mean I like it but it's not as puffy as I would have wanted it to be, but it does look good. I'm just going to press it down one more time because, like I said, this is my first time ever using this application and I don't want it to lift on me. So one more 15 second application. Came out pretty fire. I'm just trying to zoom in so y'all can see the thickness of the actual rubber. Silicone does y'all see that? I like the way it feels. Now when I do mine, I'm gonna do uh a front chest hit and either a sleeve or wrist like you know I always do. So let's go ahead and try to you know do that little right wristlet application. Here we go. Yeah, I'm feeling these joints, y'all. But I'm going to use a different color, obviously. Crew neck and hoodie. All right. That was my second 15 second application. So we're going to let this joint cool down before we peel it. Watch how they peel up with the cold peel. Bear with me because I got one hand, y'all. Came off nice, man. Nice. I wish I could feel that. That nice rubber feel. Right, I'm going to slam it down one more time. Make sure it's on there. Get y'all in close. Hold on, this looks like it came up a little bit. So let's slam it down real quick. Throw a little Teflon sheet over it. Yo, these joints gonna look fire on like an all black hoodie, white hoodie, white crew neck, cream. You know, I'm a freak it. Watch. Watch how I freak it, y'all. Yeah, so that A, that A is good now. It ain't lifting. That rubber. So like I was saying, these are the silicone heat transfer 3D transfers. Order these joints from a manufacturer out in uh, China. And um, I'm pleased. All right. So, if you are interested in getting some of your own rubber silicone 
heat transfers for your brand and you want to use my plug, I will give you all the information over it in my Patreon. In my Patreon. So make sure y'all hit that link down below. And the reason why I do things like this now is because, like I told y'all before, I am not an influencer. I am a real human being. I got a family. I have my own life. This is just what I do to help individuals out. But then there's some people that's ungrateful. They're entitled. They feel like I owe them something. I don't owe nobody shit. <laughs> first things first. Let me just get let me just clear the air on that. I don't owe nobody a goddamn thing. Alright, so if y'all want this type of application for your brand. Be on the lookout. I'm going to put it on my Patreon. But until next time, I hope y'all are working hard on y'all brands as I am on mine, baby. All right? Till next time. Skid it. The message is always in the cloth, the colors, the designs, the fit. Basically, pay attention, stay alert, and remember, choose your own path.